Hi, I'm Stacey from Eustratia. Welcome to my studio. So we'll start from here. This is my writing and computer desk. Um, I have all of my pencil cases and that stuff in these drawers here. I have some of my favourite books to give me inspiration right here, most notably the Alexander McQueen book which I picked up from the v &A exhibition last year. Um, I like to have some things to keep me calm like my lilies and my salt lamp and some crystals to keep me grounded. I have my laptop here so I can answer all of my emails and do my admin and I also have my week planner. It's very important to make lists when you're a designer and you have so many things going on at once. And also my other little Alexander McQueen book which has little cutout figures and I use these to design my collections and also my custom orders. This is my IKEA Kallax unit. I really like the way that this looks and it helps me keep all of my things organised. In this box I have um, some out outfits that are unfinished so instead of leaving them out on the table where they could get dried out from the sun I just keep them in this box and then they all stay together and all of their pieces are together and they're ready for me to work on when I next have time. Up here I have some large pattern boxes. I find it really useful to have a pattern box for each collection and then have each individual pattern inside an envelope. I have some of my favourite accessories from shows here and also some plants. I like having plants in the studio because they help oxygenate and also the lilies take some of the bad chemicals out of the um, atmosphere because obviously I work with the glue and the thinner that are not so great for your lungs. I have my IKEA Alex drawers here. These are actually really really useful for keeping all of my little bra findings and elastic and latex trim and all of those things that you need really organised and on top here I have another crystal um, a little succulent and my mannequin. Usually she's wearing underwear but I actually took the underwear off her to use in a shoot the other day and haven't managed to dress her again. So above my desk here I have um, some of my favourite pictures. This was an illustration that I did at university that was one of the things that people always talked about. This one here is um, the first image that I did when I changed my style and developed what was the forebear of the style that I have today so I thought that was a very significant photo shoot and I have that picture there. This one here is a quote of mine from a magazine feature and it says I enjoy trends and fashion but I prefer clothes that are versatile and can be carried forward from season to season. That is a statement that will always be true for me and I was really glad that they picked that out to use as my quote. And this is my cutting table. Uh, I like to have all my cutting boards laid out here so I can easily um, cut out with my blade. And above my desk I actually have a kitchen extractor fan. Now this is going to sound strange to most people but I use this to absorb the fumes when I'm gluing the latex. I also have a mask that I wear sometimes but I find it quite uncomfortable because you can't breathe very easily so I prefer to use the extractor fan. On the back wall here I have my sewing machines. As you might know Eustratia now also offers fabric clothes and I really love the idea of mixing latex with other fabrics to make more fashion forward outfits that are more wearable for a wider variety of people. I really like these little harness bras, you can wear them with everything. And one of my very special favourite things is this fake fur coat. I've never actually made a coat before so I was very um, kind of pleased with myself that I managed to put it together properly and line it and make the collar as well. I thought that was a really special piece to add to my collection. This here is my adjustable mannequin. When I make things on the stand, I like to adjust this to fit the customer's measurements and then like pleat the garment onto it, which is a very therapeutic way of working. So thanks for visiting my studio. I hope you enjoyed having a look around and seeing how I do things and hopefully see you again soon.